Hey, how's it going out there, everybody? I'm going to do a quick little video here. I had somebody ask how I made my waste oil filter. So I made it out of a five gallon bucket. And I'll kind of go through real quick how I did it. Get a your regular five gallon bucket. I just put it on a step, put a magic marker up against the bucket and on the step and hold it there and then just rotate the bucket around and that'll give you a line all the way around. Adjust that wherever you want, up or down, depending on how deep you want your bucket to be. So then I'll cut the bottom out of it. I just use my finger on the on the edge there and just go use that as a guide. And I'll cut both of those. And I use a four-inch cutoff wheel grinder and it cuts through there really easy but you can use a regular saw on that show you this real quick sorry for the delay it's a grinder with a cutoff wheel you just follow that and cut that around Cut that in about 30 seconds. So I'll go over and show you the one I've got already in my tank. And get a light on it, maybe. So this is what I've got in there. What you do is after you cut the bucket, the bottom out of it, you take a. I use a T-shirt, an old T-shirt and sandwich it in between the two, push it together, and there's a filter. You can see the stuff I got in there. There's a piece of wire, a bunch of big chunks. But after this is all ready to clean it out, you can either change it, and then I cut up this old one and then use it to start my waste oil heater. Cut it up in little pieces and ribbons, and it's ready to burn. No waste, using everything. So on this bucket, let me point out, drill a couple of holes in there, like that one there around the bottom. You could even go up a little bit higher as well, because when you're filling this full of oil, you're gonna get an air pocket in there in my in my case here with what a, my setup and it it develops air pressure in there and it doesn't want to drain so I drilled those little holes in there to let it let it drain out so I hope you like this video if you do click the thumbs up button if you don't click the thumbs up button anyway all right don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. You can really use it. Thanks for watching.